handiwork, sire. In the beginning, there was chaos. What happened to Saskia? She's alive. Wounded from our scrap, but alive. She impaled herself on a tree, and then I had to use that dagger. But she'll make it. Mountain air is good for a dragon's hide. You're the most noble human I know, Gwynblade. I'm no human. I'm glad you reminded me. My hatred for the species abated for a moment. What about Letho? Strange thing. He sits in the Temerian's former camp. I believe he awaits you. How do you know? I saw him. He's got Triss. Let's go. Tell me what happened here on the way. While you were fighting Saskia, the city was staged to a bloody spectacle. The players? There were many. At first it was a hunt for the traitors, but it soon turned into a hunt for all mages. And there were a few skirmishes between Kedweni, Redanian, and Temerian troops. Rape, pillage, and murder. Not necessarily in that order. The pastimes of the Order's pious knights. And the regular troops soon followed suit. The kings, with their choice units, left the city just after the dragon attacked. And the Nilfgaardians? Remained neutral. That is to say, they shot anyone who dared approach their camp. When we're done with you, you'll be a lump of whimpering meat. Elf! Kill the non-human! When the summit ended, we hid in one of the houses, but they found us. They cut off both my sister's hands so she wouldn't cast spells, but I managed to escape. They caught me here. Let's go, Gwynblade. This is madness. Luck Mween has changed. That's what it looks like now.
finish your story. I managed to sneak into the Nilfgaardian camp. It was relatively quiet there. Then I saw Letho leading Triss out. They let him go? No one dared stop him. I followed him. I think he noticed me. Once the fighting died down, he went to the former Temerian camp. Is Triss all right? Letho defended her from marauders. 